Phil, congratulations. Thank it's you. a winning start, but he didn't make it easy for you there. He didn't. And I, nor should he, really. You know, It's, it's uh, one of the biggest world championships we play in, and, and you should not get an easy draw. So it's, uh, I'm, I'm glad to get through, to be honest with you. Eight 180s, he didn't follow up on the 180s, so thank you, Lord. We said before, before it, that it was going to be a big test, and it's the kind of test you like to, to get yourself into a tournament. It is. I think the first round, if you can if you can get through a match like that, it's going to set you up. I've got three days now to get ready, obviously, for Thursday. So it's it's a good game for get yourself ready for the next round. It was a real close battle for that first mm. ten legs, and, and then you got that break. Did you think that that might just make him fold a little bit? It's when I went 8-7 up, and he, and he broke me. Come back to 8 each his dart, and then I broke back again. It was, it was a really funny game. In fact, we kept breaking each other. A couple of times we broke each other. But... You know, I think maybe he played better than what I did, to be honest with you. He missed doubles, that's why his average was down. But I'm through, so... You had a, a slightly, new, slightly new set of darts, slightly different take on, on the barrel there. <coughs> There's nothing wrong with the darts, that's, that's just me. You know, if the darts don't go where I throw them, that's my problem. You know, these, the, the darts probably are the best darts I've ever thrown. Hmm. Um, Unicorn keep making me darts to improve, and which I have been improving. I've been practising absolutely fantastic with them. Um, it's just me. It's just I'm... My mind is not um, 100% on what I'm doing. That's, that's the problem. I'm thinking about staying number one or retaining the title or whatever it is, but it's everything's going through my mind at the minute. I've just got to put it right. I've got three days now to settle down and put it right. It's, it's a probably fairly simple equation in the next game because Ian White's somebody from Stoke that you know yeah, yeah. very well and you know what you're going to get out you, of him. Well, he practised together. He, he, do you know if I was to lose to anybody, uh, I shouldn't say this, but probably he was one of the people... I would, would want to lose to because he's probably the nicest fella I've ever met. You know, bar you. <laughs> you know, but he is. He is one of the nicest people I've ever met in darts. And if I was going to lose to somebody, God bless him. I wish I was losing, you know, or wish I beat him in the final. Or, but he's a lovely kid. And he's someone that you've obviously seen for quite a few years on I the have. local scene. I've practiced with him for, for a few months and he's, he's very, very, very dedicated. He's, uh, I, I can't say a bad word about him he's, he's a cracking player he's a nice person and it's 15 years since which isn't always the case in our, <laughs> our game no no. 15 years since you, you've actually played him on, on TV back in the old News of the World final was it 1997? yeah good god well I never realised that he says he had long hair and a tash and he did he have had long hair and a tash <laughs> yeah 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 why well, whatever brings back a few memories it does yeah 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 I, I never realised that never realised that it's, wow. it's obviously pretty different up there. I you must have done something right then, and he must have done something right because we're still here 15 yeah. years later. Brilliant. How about the Winter Gardens? Because you've had Fantastic. so much success. Best here. venue ever. Would love to finish my career in the Winter Gardens. Never mind Alexander Palace. Winter Gardens is the one everybody wants to play in. Everybody loves the Winter Gardens. It's something magical, to be honest with you. You know, you're looking at that stage there and thinking, Shirley Bassey sang on here. Joe Longthorn sang, I'd probably take that, I've been on there, you know, everybody you can name, every famous person from the old times has been on that stage, even even John Lowe, John Lowe. Yeah. and you, and me, <laughs> I've been there, yeah, yeah. Brilliant. Well, you get to go on again, very on kind Thursday. to me this place has, so I can't, you know, I never say a bad word about it, I love it, love yeah. Blackpool, hopefully some more good memories Thursday, you're all going to see, like you, <laughs> cheers.